New PvP season has been started. You can get total of 1300 Chrono Crystals from PvP this season. You can get 1000 Chrono Crystals from getting in top ranks, you will get some Chrono Crystals even if you can't get in top ranks. You will get 300 Chrono Crystals from Exchange Shop. Just collect Winter Blizzard Medals and exchange them for Chrono Crystals in the Exchange Shop. You can get many other items by exchanging these medals. Also if you get in top ranks you will receive special medals with which you can exchange Legends Limited Characters Z Power. You can get 300 Chrono Crystals from Battle Royal. You need to collect 6 medals to exchange 300 Chrono Crystals. Each victory will give you 1 medal so you need to win at least 6 matches out of 10 matches. Then exchange your medals for 300 Chrono Crystals or other items. New co-op mode against Super Saiyan Trunks has been added. You can get 500 Chrono Crystals from this mode. If you have at least 4500 dual medals you can exchange them for 300 Chrono Crystals. You can get 200 Chrono Crystals by clearing these co-op missions. Just play 5 co-op daily and all these missions will clear easily. New event Marauding Monster has been added and you will get 600 Chrono Crystals from this event. There are 12 stages, all stages will be unlocked when you clear currently available stages. Each stage will give 50 Chrono Crystals. Complete all 12 stages to get 600 Chrono Crystals. New Zenkai Rush Battle against Super Saiyan Trunks has been added. You will get 300 Chrono Crystals by clearing all 30 stages. Use these bonus character to easily clear the stages. You can get 150 Chrono Crystals from Cell Saga Special Missions. Just complete these missions and you will get 150 Chrono Crystals. And that's how you will get 3150 Chrono Crystals in this week. Don't share this secret with anyone because it's unforgivable! I hope this video was helpful for you. If you have any suggestions or queries then please let me know in the comments section. See you in the comments, until then bye.